Hello once again to the Manhattan Project solo run through thingy. <laughs> Not college thing. Yes, you know what I mean. Hello, Duke. How are you doing? And Hal as well. We're all good. You may notice there have been a few changes. For example, the chemical thingy. The chemical extractor has gone downstairs with the reactor. The, the, the reactor. The reactor, that's it. <laughs> I'll just uh, quickly show you. Don't mind me, I'm just teleporting. Yes, you can see I've got this hideous setup. In fact, I probably need to refill the reactor. With deuterium? Yes, indeed, I do. This deuterium is not very nice. Would you put more than 64 in there? I should have to experiment. Anyway, stick some more cells in there. So, as you can see, we've got infinite water. And the reactor is just directly powering both the pump and the extractor from the battery box down here, the, the cube, sorry. It doesn't seem to be losing that much power, so I think um, it must have had a lot of power loss when it was upstairs, but now it's fine. So, not really losing any power from that. I'm hoping in the future I'll be able to get an automated system that like brings tin and glass down here and makes a load of cells. So then, and then it can sort of transport them to here when it needs them. But until then, we've got a decent setup here. It's all manual, but it works. Works fine. And the uh, reactor is creating us lots of nice, juicy power. Probably need to build some more energy cubes upstairs. So today's tasks are, well, <laughs> my to-do list won't let me write anything. So I'm not really sure what's going on there. Maybe it's because I renamed it. Oh, it won't let me rename it Book and Quill. Yeah. Oh, cramps have knocked something off there. It's the, the chisel, yes. The chisel that doesn't really work. <laughs> um, right, well. To-do list isn't working, but I kind of know what we're doing. For you just to accompany me outside. Uh, we have a spider issue. Get out of here. Um, frame rate seems to have tanked considerably since last time, and I'm not really sure why. Every time I check the log of the game, it tells me that Forestry's failed to like load a load recipe of some description. But it won't really tell me anything else, and it says that this may cause problems with your connection to the server. And because of the way Forge works, it's kind of connected to an internal server every time, so... Oh my goodness, where did you come from? Where? How? How did he even... What? Where? Where? Where did... Where? What? Where? Why? How? How? It was in... My pipe is knackered. What happened there? Have I got any more pipes in my bag? No. Well, I'll just have to wait. Where the hell did he come from? He was just there in the corner. Got plenty of light in here. Ugh. Well, that's a pain. Okay. You may notice some machines here. For the creeper through me. Yes, machines. For today is the episode where we um, increase our ores yield somewhat. So we have here three machines. We know the pulverizer. We also know, well we don't know this, the purification chamber. And this creates clumps out of ores I think. So you put the ore in and then you add some oxygen I believe from this. And you get some ore clumps which you then put into the pulverizer and I believe you get three times the dust. So what I need to do, as you can see I've filled up my infinite water supply, or what was, but I need to make it again because I need the pump. I've made a few things already, so I didn't, wouldn't waste any time. I also tried recording before and uh, had my microphone up, so it didn't really work out all that well. So, what we need stone pipes, pump. And as before, we put the pump over the middle block. Let's just see if we can remember how to power this damn thing. I think the power went into the right, so that means it needs to be the other way around, doesn't it? Oh! <laughs> right, if we put it on this side, it should. That'll do. <laughs> I can't really be bothered fumbling around with this thing. Gunpowder, go away. Don't need you. Bag of spilling, we want some universal cables. I made a load more of them. And that goes into there, la da 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 I believe this is the... That's the input. 
So it doesn't really need to be coming from the other side, but uh, oh well, I'll be right. Bit eight. So that's making, that's getting power, and now we need to bring the stone pipes over. And where the hell did he come from? That's just really annoying. They're just walking in. Ha Hang on a minute. That's not right. I'll tell you what else isn't right. The frame rate. Ugh, I don't know what's up with it. It's really annoying. It's flipping. Pain the bomb. The bomb and the bomber. Right. Oh, is, are they coming in from up there? Okay. Well, that kind of makes sense. Because as you can see, we've got an iron door up there with um, obsidian pressure plate, so it shouldn't really be coming in from up there. Because it's because of the walls, they're so black down here. It's kind of hard to see whether it's light or dark. So what we really, really need to do is block up this. Uh, I'll use some quartzite cobblestone. Just to yeah, that'll do. That'll be fine. We won't be able to waltz in now and uh, make a mess of things. Just gracious me. It must be where that creeper came from then. <laughs> Again, thrown off by stupid monsters. Where did the pipe come from? Was it from the back? Oh, that makes, makes things a bit more tricky. Cable management is the bane of every computer user. Even when they're playing games, by the looks. So let's bring the pipe over. I'm not going to have enough pipe. Whew. Let's turn it around again. <sighs> we'll get there in the end. Right, so... We need it to be, need it to be kind of facing. That works. Yeah, that's perfect actually. Now we just need pipe to be going in that side. Hack away at this. Oh, Gunpowder again. Go away. Uh, get rid of this doit. Um, bring the stone pipe. From back, it was from the back, wasn't it? Yes. That is correct. Into. Now, where does it plug in to this? That's the big question. To the top? By the looks of things, that is indeed the answer. Oh, Again, just enough pipe. So now, we should hopefully be. Oh, here we go, yeah. We're getting hydrogen and oxygen. Now, the problem is. A, it's the wrong way around, so. Oh, God. <laughs> ah. Pressurized tubes. These carry gas from mechanism. So the oxygen should be coming out now. Or not. What the hell? How does this work? Pray tell. Um Hang on, so could I put a pressurized tube in the front of it? I know it needs power, but no. That's where the power goes. <sighs> Oh dear, oh dear. <laughs> this could be tricky. Well, we've got hydrogen, we've got oxygen. So what we need to be happening is for the oxygen to be going to here, I believe. Let me just check the chart again. Yes, the oxygen needs to be going into the purification chamber. We also need an ore. I haven't brought an ore with me, but I'm hoping that shouldn't be a problem. Just have some pumpkin pie. Mm -mm -mm. Yes, out with the bloomer, in with the pumpkin pie. Oh, now I've got... I think, actually, this... Oh, did I just walk through that pipe? Okay. It's in a really awkward position, that pipe. I believe, once it fills up with hydrogen, it stops working. So we need... We need this gas tank that I made before, if you remember. And I think we need to connect it up, somehow. Does that work? Yes! Sweet, okay. So now that's emptying the hydrogen into there. Oh, wow, I can actually see it as well. That's what I'm talking about. Now, quite quite what happens when um, this fills up, I'm not sure. Maybe, maybe they'll both fill up. That's a bit of a pain. But, yeah, that's, that's good. So that's working. And the hydrogen's going... Crap. What? How... How do we deal with this? Maybe... Because the wiki doesn't really tell me how this thing works. I'll have to give it another perusal. Maybe the oxygen comes out the bottom? Just need to break these pipes, I think. No, because they're full of hydrogen now, are they? Oh no! They're both the same colour! 
Oh dear. Is that filling up with oxygen now? Oh, oh, I don't know. All right, time to consult the wiki. The wiki kind of um is wrong. <laughs> I don't know how that can be, but basically. It says to pipe from the sides, and that doesn't work, obviously. I've just tried to connect these pressurized tubes and they don't do anything when they're connected to the sides. So I'm not really sure what's going on there. Also, it's full of oxygen. Fortunately, I can press a dump and I'll just release it to the atmosphere. I'm very confused. Well, maybe we just need an ore. Let me go and grab an ore. There's an ore there. That'll work. Come here. With loads of ores. Lovely. Yay! Just fill that back in. Yeah. <laughs> Doesn't look hideous at all. If I stick an ore in here now, what happens? Very little. What am I doing wrong here? Oops. Oh, look! The oxygen's coming out of that pipe now. How am I rotating it if I've not got the wrench on my tool? I don't stink now. Oh, hang on. Hang on a minute. Oh, hey, there's a big, big cave underneath here. Oh, thank goodness. Um... Okay, that's a bit odd. Let's leave that. Oh, so it's not actually piping out at the bottom at all. But somehow the the, the, the tank's full of gas anyway. Eh? Okay. Oops. Oh. Output! Ah, there we go! Oh, nice! Right, <laughs> I've done it. I've done it. I've finally done it. Right. There, so now it's outputting oxygen into this thing. Hey, there we go. So the purification chamber is actually doing things now. And that should create for us clumps. Now, hopefully. Yeah, there we go. Iron clumps. They're not being accepted into the pulverizer. Maybe. Oh! And now I've got dirty iron dust. I can't help but notice about that I only got one dust per... Oh no, what am I talking about? Of course you only get one dust. Look. One iron ore equals three clumps, which equals three dust. Dirty dust. And you can... I think you stick the dirty dust into something else. I think it's the enrichment chamber and you get clean dust. Right, so we do actually need... the other thing. We also need some redstone engines to pipe out of here. Didn't bring any pipes though. Okay, bear with me while I go and get some more ores and a pipe. Here we go. I wonder if Mechanism has its own pipes. I, I assume it does. Don't believe it relies on Buildcraft. Okay, where's my redstone engine? It's in here. And I've also got some torches. Right. So, let's make a hole here. Obviously not enough pipe to go around. The wires even. Hmm, maybe. Maybe there is. Should really put them along this wall as well. Oh, it's hydrogen. Ah, now you see. It's still creating loads of hydrogen. Just gotta keep pressing dump. I wonder if there's a way to automatically dump the hydrogen. I don't know. Just don't know. Right, so I've got a lot of iron clumps. Get the redstone the pipe there. And that should go into the pulverizer, which I just need to set up so everything's facing the right way. Oops. There we are. Now let's see if it actually goes in properly. Okay, I've got some iron here. 
stick that in there. Wow, what a noise. So that makes us some clumps. I've uh, forgotten to put the... Oh! That's a bit strange. Does it even need to be a wooden pipe then? Yes, it does. But it doesn't need the redstone touch to be powered at all. That doesn't make much sense. Oh well. Oh. Uh. Oh. Going in the wrong. Going the wrong way. Uh. Just break this quickly. It's obviously not working. Uh. There we go. Sight all these again. <whistles> there. Okay. Um, and pretend that we actually put that in there. Right, look at all that dirty iron dust. So we've actually made a huge return on that five iron that I picked up. So now I need an enrichment chamber. Enrichment chamber is fairly easy to make if I remember. It just requires some steel casing, some control circuits, and some enriched alloys. And I've got a fair few spiders to deal with by the sound of things. Yeah, two spiders and a creeper. That spider's in the tree, bugging out a bit. They still haven't fixed that, have they? Okay, stick these in here. I've actually got an alternative to this that I'll show you another time. So, oh. Smelt these? Why have not? I don't think the dirty iron dust is actually smeltable, or is it? No, you can't just smelt that because it's all dirty and horrible. 